What's up everyone? This is Eric Stanton with Stanton Pools and Valley Pool Plaster. Just walking in, checking on one of the jobs that we started. We just chipped it out uh, right before the rain, so now it's flooded with rain. And uh, we gotta drain that out. But I wanted to go over a common question that I get from a lot of people is, what are the different stages of a remodel? Um, and uh, there's actually about a handful of them. Uh, the remodel process usually takes about three weeks on average, depending on how much you're looking to have done. Uh, but the first step is obviously going to be to drain the pool, uh, which usually takes somewhere between six and 12 hours, and we handle that for you. Uh, generally, the next day, uh, we're gonna come and we're gonna chip out the pool. We're gonna use uh, either, you know, pneumatic tools, uh, pneumatic hammers, pneumatic chisels, and we're gonna have a group of guys. Generally, it takes about four hours, um, and then we clean up when we're done. It's the loudest process of the remodel phase. Now, after we chip out the pool, we're gonna inspect it for any cracks, do crack repair for you, and do any plumbing or, uh, or electrical work that you chose to have done, whether it's splitting the drain, replacing the skimmer, replacing the light niche, uh, that's when that happens. Then if you've chosen to do the coping, we'll replace the coping and then we move right into the tile. Uh, we'll replace the waterline tile and do any step trim tile that you chose to do. Uh, following that, we will apply the surface. Generally takes about half a day to apply the surface. And if you do plaster, we immediately begin to fill. If you chose pebble, which is what most people choose to do, uh, then we do the, uh, the acid wash startup, which is the following day. Uh, generally takes a few hours and we immediately begin to fill the pool. A lot of times people think that the pool shouldn't be filled until it cures, but no, it actually cures underwater. And uh, once the pool is full, you'll give us a call back. We'll do the post fill startup and then we'll do any work on the equipment. If you need us to plumb in a new pump, a new filter, a new heater, that's when that happens at the very end so that we can run through it, test it, and see if there's any leaks. And again, this process, depending on what you choose, usually two weeks to six weeks, uh, but the most, most of our remodels take about three weeks. Uh, so that's it. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to me. Uh, again, I'm Eric Stanton.